What's good? What's good, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of The Urban Platform Speaks. Uh, with that being said, man, don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, you know, and uh, I'm going to get right into this this topic, man. We, 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 LeBron James is winding down, you know what I mean? To like, uh, his career is winding down. So LeBron James will probably be leaving within the next probably two years or so. He'll be leaving the league. And that got me to thinking about, um, like, you know, like, and, and people say that, like, Bronny James, his career is not is probably not going to be too much longer, right? So this will be an opportunity for the league to have a uh, a father-son, the first ever father-son uh, farewell tour. Now, I remember back in the day when they, when they did a farewell tour for Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, you know, Every town, every every city that he went to um, honored him by giving him different gifts and stuff like that. So I can see that happening for LeBron. You know, um, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, like at one city, I remember they gave him a Harley Davidson. Um, at another town, they gave him like a leather jacket. I think the leather jacket had like all the different uh, NBA teams on it, um, you know, plaques and stuff like that. And so I, I can see them doing that for uh, LeBron James. But but Bronny James only you know he'll he'll at, by this time he'll probably only be in the league for like four years right so what do you get a player who's only been in the league for four years you know what I mean because you can't get him the same thing that you would get somebody like Kareem you know um you you know you got Kareem a plaque so I don't know you get Bronny like a certificate or something because he only played four years um. Kareem got a, 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 you know, a leather jacket with all the, the, the teams and logos and stuff on there. And so I guess for Bronny, you would get Bronny like a, a maybe a, a, like a yellow tank top. You know what I mean? To match the, uh, the Lakers. Um, you know, I'm, I'm kind of at a loss. I'm like, what do you get a guy who's only played in the league for four years? Because in my opinion, once, once LeBron James leave the league. LeBron, you know, Bronny James will be right with him, you know, because, I mean, he he's just not qualified. And I don't see him being qualified by the time that uh, his father leave the league. I don't see him being, you know, any different or or anything like that. So my my thing is, I, I want y'all to leave some comments. Like I already said, you know, I think, you know, maybe they'll give him a, some type of certificate for playing, you know, uh, some type of participation trophy. Uh, maybe a uh, a yellow tank top, you know, they can't let him keep the uniform because you can't retire his uniform. So maybe, <coughs> maybe not, a, uh, you know, a uniform, but get him a yellow tank top. Um, uh, what about, can't get him a rocking chair, maybe a, a bench, you know, get him a bench or something. But um, yeah, what do you get a guy who's been in the league, you know, who's who's retiring after four years of playing basketball, you know? And, uh, you know, you want to I think it's only right that you send this guy off, um, you know, in a, in a respectful manner. So that's my question to y'all. Like, I want y'all to send us some suggestions. Um, let me know what do you think that uh, Bronny James should get, you know, for his retirement tour, because I'm sure he'll be doing his tour at the same time his father's doing his. And, um, you know, I think LeBron James will get some nice gifts, you know, but. Bronny James, yeah, I don't think he's played long. He'll be in the league long enough to get, you know, the same gifts that his father got. And so that's why I need y'all help. I need y'all to tell me, like, what gifts should um should Bronny James get for, you know, his his time that he spent in the in the in the NBA. Um, and so what I'm gonna do is, you know, I'm going to I do a live show on Sundays at 11 a.m. And I'm going to be reading some of y'all suggestions, you know, on the live show. So, um, yeah, make sure to leave your suggestions and I'll, I'll read them, you know, on Sunday. Uh, with that being said, don't forget to like and subscribe and I will check you all out in the next video. Peace.